in this last couple of weeks now, some of the special weather projects done by the kids at Valley View Elementary. A lot of kids focusing on severe weather, and tonight's focus, again, is on tornadoes. This one was uh, one My that I helped My name is Henry, and I go to Valley View Elementary, and, and my question was, how a tornado forms? And this is a picture of a tornado that I found on the Internet, and it's very skinny. And if you see a tornado like this, it, where it's really skinny, it's going really fast. And this is a page of how I would say a tornado forms. So it starts with the wind shear. So the, the winds are blowing and in two different directions. And then the vortex forms with updrafts and downdrafts. And then the funnel cloud forms the bottom of a cloud and then it finally touches the ground and that's when it's a tornado. Scott Ravel explains it. Here's a picture of a tornado. This is a major tornado right here, a large one. We don't typically get strong tornadoes in Idaho, but we do get tornadoes in Idaho. The scale, which I'll talk about, the strength of these storms is an EF so Henry came to the studios you saw and, and that's how this all started that's why we went off to the school there because we heard about the weather projects that Henry, Henry and the rest of his classmates were working on so I helped him out by explaining how tornadoes form Henry did a good job of taking that analysis and understanding himself exactly how tornadoes forms that mid-level rotation that we talked about wind shear in opposite directions wind blowing and then that being drawn up into the uh, storm system and then the funnel uh, dropping down from that so uh, great job there Henry it was great having you in the studio as well as we were discussing tornadoes. We've got a couple more weather projects. In fact, there are some that will be just on our website. We'll be posting all of these. And so if you go to Idaho on your side and click on my weather blog, you'll be able to catch uh, all of those different projects that we had. And Henry was here, and uh, <laughs> it was great to have him here. And I thank him for inviting me to his class to talk to all the other kids as well. All right. Thanks, Scott. We appreciate that. Thanks, Scott. Coming up.